old cherry lovers. Well, back up on the farm. We got a lot of things going on this weekend. For one, let me turn this thing around and show you. As you can see ahead of me here, we got lumber. We got lumber. We got this all going. Okay, let me tell you what we got going on. We got these two by two by eights, 18 foot long. And we got a total of four four by sixes. Those are the posts that'll go down the center to hold up those two by eights. And we got those two by two by uh, yeah two by eights that go on the uh, far garage door on the top down at the very end. But that lumber will go over here, and as you can see, the where the metal comes to the top, there's going to be a ridge plate that goes all the way down, and all these rafters, these boards are going to tie into this. That is going to be our roof for this high tunnel. Once we put the rafters up, then in the in the shed, I've got 120 feet by 40 feet of extra thick poly that'll go over, and that'll be our high tunnel, and that will take a hundred times the load that the the metal that you see still laying here took when we took all that snow. I no longer I no longer have to worry about a snow load because it'll take it and as soon as the sun comes like like always if you watch any of my videos past videos in the winter when it comes as the sun comes out it'll slide right off we had come to determination that the the metal didn't hold enough weight to support a heavy load but this wood will and then we don't have to worry it the poly was not the determining factor of the, the high tunnel failing it was the structure of the metal so we're going to beef this up and it's going to be better and <laughs> much better than it was before and we'll have the, the snow load i need i don't have to use my q-tip anymore i probably will occasionally when i'm up here but i don't have to worry about it i will you know all of this will be put back together uh this one is going to get done here right within this weekend uh the next one well, we're going to wait till next spring. We'll put that one all together and then we'll be back like we back before the disaster struck. So anyways, I thought I'd stop just a minute and give you guys a quick video of everything that we're going to do. And yes, <laughs> uh, I'm going to be filming it all. So I'm going to show you guys everything that I'm going to do here. We're going to get this all put back to normal and get on track for working for next spring and get things going because I intend to see what happens next year with these cherry trees. So got a lot going on, got a lot of things I got to get done. I'm going to film them to you. I'm going to bring you along. You'll probably please see two, three videos of us putting this high tunnel together. And like I said, come along and watch us for right now. If you like this video, hit the thumbs up, like, and subscribe. And we'll see you on the next one, and we'll be constructing this high tunnel back to normal. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye now. Oh, one other thing, uh, cherry lovers. Let me walk around and show you. My daughter has bought her a trailer that she plans on doing some traveling with. Very nice one. So I thought I'd I'll walk around and show you this. It's called No Boundaries. It's a nice trailer on the inside and out. I will show you the outside and then I'll take you in and show you the inside real quick. But she has a nice place and uh, she plans on doing some traveling and, and this is gonna meet her needs. So she's up here giving it a test, 24 footer, and it is very sharp. So, all right, let's walk inside and take a look at the interior of the place. Very, very, very nice place. So let's walk in and see what's going on. She's got the air conditioning on and here's here it is. Bathroom in the back, 
air conditioning, TV, heat, refrigerator, huge refrigerator, full shower in the back, full bathroom, full sink, full toilet. Up front, it's a couch, and then this pulls down and makes a queen size bed, and this turns into a bed, at which it folds out. But this is a very, very nice travel trailer. Very there's Titan. He loves this place, so he's waiting for Papa to come back out. But yes, it's a very nice, nice unit, and I think she's going to enjoy it. So thought I'd stop by and show you guys that. All right, see you on the next one. Bye now.